What's going on guys? This is Sergeant Merrill and every now and then I come across an organization that I don't think gets nearly enough attention. Uh, we've all heard of uh, you know the Wounded Warrior Project. These guys have gotten huge over the past couple years and for good reason. They have an awesome cause, they're doing great things, they have awesome products uh, and everybody can kind of get behind it. You know, Who wouldn't want to support our Wounded Warriors? And by that same token, I've come across another organization, and they are called the Warrior Shoot Event Group. And these guys, it seems like they're just getting started, but they say they started back in 2007. Uh, so here they've been going for about six or seven years. And what they do is they help wounded warriors or our wounded veterans, our disabled veterans, get back to the range. So when you're in the military, it's kind of hard not to develop a passion or a hobby for firearms. I mean, it's, it's just part of what you do. You can't even get promoted if you're not good at shooting firearms. It's part of your promotion points. Um, and a lot of us develop a hobby for it. There, there, there's nobody that I knew in the military that were like, well, I don't like firearms. <laughs> you know? Once you get out to the range and you start firing and you start learning the ins and outs of it, you really start to enjoy it. It really becomes a hobby. Uh, so if, for a lot of these wounded warriors, when they come back, it, it may be difficult for them to get back to the range, uh, especially when they're missing body parts. If they don't have uh, an arm, if they don't have a leg, you know, it, it, it may be a physical physical constraint that's stopping them from getting back to the range, or it may be an emotional constraint. In either case, what these guys do is they host these events where they take these wounded warriors and do whatever needs to be done to get these guys to the range to enjoy their hobby. Uh, it's therapeutic in a way for them, and I think it's outstanding. I mean, you know, for a guy with no arms and legs to come to you and say, I'd really like to go back to the range, there's a lot of logistics involved. So these guys do a lot. I think they have an outstanding cause. I want to uh, bring a little bit of attention to it. I know I'm not huge on the Internet or anything, but I know that you guys that follow me might have the same interest in promoting these guys as well. They uh, they got a good thing going, and I'd like for them to get bigger. So in the link down in the description, you can check out their Facebook page. Like it, follow it, help them in any way you can. I'd like to see them get as big as Wounded Warrior Project because they're doing a great thing. But that's all I have for this video, guys. This is Sergeant Merrill out here.